Thursday. Guys, how's it looking out there? It's looking a lot better. It's just still wet. I mean, mm -hmm. we've got some showers that are going to be with us, but our severe threat has moved on. Yeah, so right now still some rain in the area. Still even a few thunderstorms out there in the southern counties. But yeah, heaviest of that stuff is out of here. Hallelujah, because it was loud overnight. But we had also a lot of rain as well. Yeah, we did. So a lot of you all picking up a half an inch to an inch of rain. Several of our Skynet sensors even over an inch. But right now our view from Murfreesboro showing that right now you're 71. Mostly cloudy, looks like a few breaks in the clouds. But uh, in the early morning hours, you picked up 0.83 in the rain gauge there from our camp camera at one public square highs for you today mid 80 so this is down just a little bit normal high for today right around the 91 degree mark 84 columbia 84 shelbyville upper 70s back over to crossville lafayette 81 and right around 85 for clarksville meanwhile for folks trying to enjoy maybe some corn dogs hot dogs mm -hmm. or maybe some funnel cakes at the williamson yes. county fair a better evening for it Six o'clock when the gates open up right around 80, 77 at eight o'clock when the gates close, 73. I will note though, gates close at uh, 10 o'clock. The midway stays open until 11 o'clock. I think they'll be open until midnight tomorrow night for the midway. I'll show you what is happening on that muggy meter. So it comes down, still noticeable, it comes down, but we're going to take this thing back up to muggy, almost at times downright steamy as we get ready for the weekend. 91 for you on Saturday, 90 on Sunday. We'll keep an eye on Saturday, a couple of showers and storms developing. One or two of those may be on the strong side, but here's a look at radar for us right now. Not much here. There's still quite a bit of lightning showing up down toward the Memphis area. But we see some of the rain right now from Wayne County, Lawrence County, and back over toward the Marshall County area for us now. We see some of the showers uh, now east of uh, uh, Carthage and some of the showers back over toward Cookville and then back over toward Crossville. But again, Nikki D, while some of this may be some moderate rain, no severe storms in the area. And thankfully, we ended up only having one severe thunderstorm warning throughout the overnight time frame. Did it get close to criteria? Some of them did. Did it seem like some should be severe. Well, there was so much lightning that it did sadly strike a little fear, but hopefully we were able to calm me down and keep the peace. Still dealing with some showers as Leland pointed out. They're hugging right along the Alabama Tennessee state line and they're going to continue to move on out as winds will be out of our south and then starting to be out of our southwest 5 to 15 miles per hour today. We're going to start to dry out as Leland pointed out. Great night to head over to the Williamson County Fair or just to get outside. Enjoy the afternoon as we'll have plenty of sunshine to be with us and with the clear skies as we head throughout dinner continuing overnight temperatures are going to tumble back into the upper 60s and low 70s as we make our way throughout tomorrow we'll see a nice dry day in place but a few clouds will start to move in still overall nice afternoon in place before the heat and humidity make another impression across the area saturday Looking to see a few scattered showers early on. Models have yet to come in agreement on the exact timing, but it does look like they will be north of I-40. And as far as the severity, just generic thunderstorms as they then will continue to move their way just off to the east by the afternoon. Not a complete washout. Don't take this as the gospel because this is actually the first time this model has shown all of that precipitation across the plateau. Your seven day forecast highs today, 85 degrees. We're about to take that rainfall out of here shortly, 88 for tomorrow. That's going to be your driest and most comfortable, but that heat and humidity return just in time for the weekend. Yeah, so as we go into the weekend, highs upper 80s to around 90 Saturday and Sunday, three and 10 shot at a shower and thunderstorm both days, and we'll watch for a front on Monday, increasing that chance for rain just a bit, but then behind it, highs mid 80s on Tuesday and on Wednesday. I mean, and look at the morning lows. I know, right? 60s with some areas across the plateau in the 50s. Mm -hmm.